I'm Patrice Camo, and we are inside Camp Space, a studio located right in Hyattsville, Maryland. Camp Space is a content creator studio, and we really are the hub um, for influencers, creators, individuals that really want to create their content and distribute it to the masses. So the space can be rented hourly for photo shoots, video shoots, podcast recordings, small business type of events. Pretty much, you know, we want this space to be the playground and the canvas for you to create all the things that you want to put out into the world. Our typical customer are women of color that are based in the DC area. So to be really specific, we, we focus on, you know, someone that is aged 33 to 44-ish who may have a full-time job, but also has a passion project that needs to come to a space and shoot their headshots shoot their video content, do their cooking tutorials. All of those things can be done here. Maybe record a podcast or two. Um, and to give some background, so the space opened in 2018 as a co-work space. So I decided about a year and a half after we opened in August, September of 2019, that we would pivot, leave co-working, be done with it, and really be this content studio, just, own, just like hone in and, and honor and serve the customers that have been coming coming through the space. So, you know, we officially became a content creator studio. Our audience, our main audience are women of color. Of course, anybody can shoot here. Our doors are open. Um, but I did understand and see that there was, some, uh, there was a void in the market. Um, and so this is hopefully what that, what that fills in and completes. In the last six months, my eyes have been open to all the different things that can be done in the space. You know, you create something and you have this vision of what you want it to be or what you think it's gonna be, but it takes for customers to come in and show you all of the all of the potential. So we've had artists come in, actually painting visual artists who exhibit their work, but in in owning this new space of being a content studio, I've had a lot of influencers, social media influencers come into the space. Women of color who have been, who are like really serious about their voice, really serious about the community that they're building online, um, and women who have taken that voice and that community and sprouted it to all these different business ventures. So, for example, there is an influencer, she's based out of Baltimore, but she shot in here a few times, Ty Alexander. And I mean, she, I remember she kind of burst on the scene because she was an African-American influencer, very body positive, um, and she also had gray hair. And at the time, like there weren't a lot of natural gray hair women who were younger, but you know, her hair was hereditarily gray. And she was able to take that market and really hone in on it. Um, and so she booked the, the space to shoot some brand partnerships. One, I don't remember the brand, but it's a very well-known brand. And to have her come here, shoot with this, with this well-known brand, and then have another influencer shoot that content and just see it all kind of put together was really eye-opening to me. Um, and showed me that not only are we a space for individuals who need to shoot content, but brands that want to connect with DC influencers, um, they can come here as well. So that really was what showed me what, what can be. I'm so excited to be a part of this Hidden Gems segment. Um, and why I think it's super cool to be like the low key hidden, you gotta know about it to know about it. The only way that we succeed is if more people know about us in Camp Space. So please visit our website, www.campworkspace.com. We are on all social platforms, well maybe not all, but the ones that I'm really active on are Instagram, Twitter, and Facebook. The same name is at Camp Spaces. So it's Camp Space with an S at the end. That S was very deliberate because the goal is to open more. Um, and yeah, just, just connect with us. Um, you know, I would love to be able to serve as many Prince George's County creators as possible. I'm a Prince George's County native. I went to Austin Hill High School, went to University of Maryland. We still live right here in Prince George's County. And, you know, I think it's so important to continue to build businesses and, and circulate that dollar within our community. So definitely check us out.